in Kashmir's Poonch district. Four soldiers were in fact killed in action in a targeted attack. Following this incident, the Indian Army is in fact planning to increase the number of troops to curb terror activities in the region. Amidst Kashmir Security Forces' ongoing terror operation, the Indian Army chief also visited the Poonch Rajori sector. Now, during his visit, General Manoj Pandey was briefed by the top commanders about the current operations and the steps that will be taken to target terrorists effectively in the coming days. Now, the army chief is expected to visit the stretch again with senior defense ministry functionaries. The sources say that Pakistan's army is looking to revive terrorism in the Punch Rajori sector in order to pressurize the Indian army to cut down its troops on the northern border with China. The Indian Army has been in a military standoff with China in the, over the course of the last three years and has held multiple rounds of talks to de-escalate the situation there. And our correspondent Idris Lone has sent us this report. Listen in. Indian Army's Chief Manoj Pandey is on a visit to the Union Territory of Jammu in Kashmir. He's visiting Rajori district uh, where we saw a spate of recent attacks taking place and he's there to take a stock of the situation. Uh, there's a review, a security review meeting that he's holding in the Rajori district and also uh, especially uh, the recent attack that took place in Rajori. He'll also be briefed about uh, that. We've been told uh, that uh, the Defence Minister will also so, uh, be visiting uh, the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir in a couple of days. Uh, today, the whole uh, Jammu region, not only Rajori and Punch, but the whole of Jammu region has been put on high alert. Security has been beefed up uh, and now the investigations uh, will be done that why is it that uh, a number of uh, attacks are taking place, especially in Rajori and Punch area of the Jammu district. With video journalist Feroz Idris Lone for Vyond World is One. Vyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.